everyone, my name is Mohamed Ashim Gulum. I am a student of a school gymnasium named after Shamsha Kaldayakhov, which is located in Turkestan region of Trashaudir. My teacher is Sultan Hanava Baljan Lisbek Kazam. I study with Excel book for the ninth grade. Uh, and the theme of my video could hologram technology be the future of video calls? I chose the theme because my honest reaction was utterly gobsmacked. This is weird, isn't it? Many scientists and doctors have been working with sophisticated technology to develop uh, robotic limbs that can be attached to humans. With this technology, people who don't have an arm or a leg uh, will have the chance to live almost normal lives again. Some scientists believe that we're entering the age of cybernetics, where men and machine are going to become one. No one really knows though how far this will go. What is for sure is that people who, who need them will soon have artificial limbs that they will be able to control with microchips in their brains. Some scientists believe that it will be possible to make artificial eyes that can see better than human eyes. We're not quite there yet, but the idea of a real cybernetic man is uh, becoming closer and closer to become reality. Hologram technology is a three-dimensional projection that can be seen without any special equipment such as cameras or glasses. Viewing the tabletop-sized pop is like watching a 3D movie without the glasses but with chunky characters and objects appearing like they're physically inside. Oh well, hello! I can't believe I'm actually speaking to you now live in Shaozi. I'm actually not a hologram, I'm really in this thing, let me out. We wanted to go from the boardroom and the conference room to the living room. You know, we shouldn't have to be a millionaire or a celebrity or even a digital resurrection of a late legend. This should be so, you know, if Grandma and Timmy can communicate whether they are 10 miles away or 10,000 miles away. When, you know, a volumetric real-sized person even shrunk down into a tabletop-sized version of a person material sizes into a space, there's just much more emotional connection that just doesn't exist when you just just up on a flat 2D display. This is sort of like if Zoom and being there had a baby. This is real empty space within the box, the shadows inside the walls, the reflections uh, that create illusion of physical presence. Uh, what about that physical connection that you have with people when you meet them for the first time? People are no longer traveling from city to city to city and spreading jet fuel all over the earth. As we were well aware, but video calls can be temperamental even with the slightest of delays putting us off. And this is very sleek, even with hotspotting of a 4G on my phone. We've gotten the transmission to around 200 milliseconds, which perceptively is instantaneous to anybody interacting any holographic devices. As you have seen, the acquisition is super complicated. It requires multiple cameras, multiple ankles, chroma key device. We're able to achieve holographic transmission with one camera today. To do automatic demographic age recognition, uh, so we can even understand if you're male or female, your age range, and serve your content to that effect. They'll cost around two grand when it hits the mass markets, but Proto is already working with big brands uh, to help them vlog stuff, and is also entering the health and education sectors. They're using it so doctors can be mean and train future healthcare providers. They're uh, teaching students in multiple universities how to treat, how to diagnose people at the exact same time. 